tuning in to SteamboatsMyHome.com video blog. This week's video blog has nothing to do with real estate, but it has everything to do with Steamboat Springs. It is March 27th. My buddy and I, Lars, are biking into the tailwaters of Stagecoach Reservoir. That's the reservoir there, frozen over. We have our fishing waders on, and we are headed down to some of the best trout fishing around Steamboat Springs. trying to do is um, get it as close to the bank as possible while it's still in the nice fast water. That was decent. Reeling it in. There's one. I don't know if I can get this one in. Whoa! It's definitely gonna be a workout. Going definitely strong fish. Gotta keep that rod bent. Look at that, it's going up river. It's a strong fish. If I lose it in the current, it could easily break off. Because I'm working on 6X right now, so it's a really thin line. See, it knows. It knows it's going in the, the bushes there. What I want it to do is, I think, go down, get in the rep, get in the fast water, and then go down into the slower water if I could. Oh my goodness. That's a big fish. There we go. Now, Good, it's going down in the slower water. I can maybe go out into this uh, slower waters here, up there. I can't play it too hard, because again, my line is 6X, so that's a pretty small tippet. But it needs to be small, because this water is so clear, and these fish are so used to seeing a lot of pressure. This thing's not giving up anytime soon. I don't know if I'm gonna make this one. Here it comes. Oh my goodness. Maybe I can get it. In these slow waters, if I could get its head up. Ready?
Well, it's about 10.30 in the morning. That concludes our morning fishing. Thanks for tuning in to SteamboatsMyHome.com video blog. And we'll see you next week.